Let's see if I can get it right this time. Come on, nigga! Hey guys, here we are at Watkins Glen. Track named after me. Well, maybe I was named after the track. It's still in debate. Um, we're in the USF 2000 Formula Sprint. We've just had an update. And when you see USF 2000 in the update list, you think they've fixed it. But they haven't. So press Control F12. See Orient here. Take away the 18. Flip it around 180 degrees. And then have a look at this. This car is still sitting on the ground. There's the horizon. You see that tiny little line? That's on a f the straight bit. Any sort of bump or anything is actually holding the car back. I'm a little bit miffed, to be honest. So we had a thing in the forums about um, just turn the sound down, basically, that crashing sound. But it's not. They need to fix the setup. And we're car seven at the moment, qualified in ninth, which is not very good. I do need to take my top off. Cue the music. And um, yeah, let's do this. The air temp is 26 mm. Celsius. Good luck, everyone. E9. Quick wardrobe change. <laughs> Something I forgot to do before pressing record, but hey, this is all unscripted. And yesterday. I had an issue with my pedals. Where towards the end of the race, it was looking good. I was. I think it was car 7 in that one as well and my Fanatec pedal the throttle freebie it's got the hole up to redress it <coughs> so I decided to go full throttle and get stuck there I was coming right up to the bus stop I was about this far away from the guy in front and I just had to swerve go through the bus stop, crash into the wall and ended up two laps down. And the unfortunate thing about that was it was like 2,600 strength of field. So that was my race for yesterday. Joy. So I went and got the old lithium grease, which is uh, that there. And yeah, we'll get through the bus stop, shall we? Don't want to be like that guy who spun. This is something that I read on the forums. Go and get that. Probably D40 lithium grease. I think that's what it's called. White lithium grease. High performance. And straight away, the, that friction feel between the shafts is gone. I just hope the um, the full throttle thing is gone, the problem. We're on the inside this time. Watkins, but I do like being on the outside, turn one. He's in front, Matt, Matt's got control. He's probably gonna be right up there with. Okay, Glenn. Nice and neat. Stay out of trouble. Green, green, green. Nice and messy. 15 minutes left. That's 15 minutes. Left side. Stay right. Three wide. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Wow, tough Where'd crowd. Far left. Hold your line. You guys are all Three idiots. Two left. Clear left. Forget about the stop. Find your rhythm. Here it comes. Right side. Clear right. You're clear.
That was a dumb start. Gonna find in this side of the track has no bumps. And there's parts of um, turn two and three as well. It's about you, mate. B15. So I'm staying on this side. No bumps. And a better top speed. When I get turn one right. <laughs> right, here we go. Still haven't got this corner right yet. The optimal's down to a 12.5. I know the best I've done is a 12.6. I know I can do better than that. He's not going to want to give anything away, so set this corner up. Yellow flag, watch out. Right, we're we'll going on the inside for the slipstream. It's a bit messy further up the road. Fields compressing. Release. Off you go, boys. Okay, Glenn, the next car is Alvarez. Guys are driving like garbage today, far out. Right, 
right side. Keep it steady. Still there. Clear right. You've just done a 114.38. Yellow flag, caution. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. Keep it steady. Still there. Is that braking element? Still there. Hold your line. Clear left. Here we go. Right out here, less friction on the road. These guys can fight amongst themselves up there. That right point. Left side, clear to the left. You know he's on there, that's the main thing. Have to clear my boss. Thank you. Some terrible right. driving there, Thomas. Still there. Still there. Clear right. Well done, good pass. On your left. Clear left. You just cut the track. You need to slow down and give back some time.
Car right, clear right. Right side, clear to the right. Don't let this guy distract you. to Sanchez behind is increasing it's now 0.9 that last lap was at 112.64 you're fucking idiot How much you should be paying for that? That's terrible. Just two minutes left, two minutes to go. Left side. Clear away. That run. Still there. Still there. Hold your line. Give him room. Steady. Still there. Clear to the left. That lap time was 114.05. Sector 2 is 0 0.9. Off the pace. What flag fever? That's two minutes left. Two minutes. Congrats, Matthew. P4. Okay, it's over. Well done, mate. Good finish. 
Thomas, that was some of the worst driving I've ever seen. Sometimes when a guy's got a run on you, you yield the spot, and then the next lap, you go for a, to try and get it back. Trying to cut and weave and push people off the track is disgraceful. That had to be said. Oh, I'm getting so old. Far out. But, well, we went to last, didn't we? Let them all go. You're being idiots. I'm happy with that. <clears throat> yeah, and who knocked? Let's have a look at lap one, because Matt... Um, where are we? We need to have a look. At the proper angle. What a mess. Let's go to Matt. That's Matt. That's the guy who's in control of the, the start. So who was he knocked off by? He's got the inside line. You know, what are they saying? We gave room. Look at the contact. Start was a shit show and it was a crash at T1. Yeah, sorry, Matt. I reckon um, that was a bit of a bungled start on your behalf, mate. You did kind of move right across towards the wall. You reckon? He's got control of the race, so the start. It doesn't mean he has control of the circuit. All right, he's taken the inside line, all good. They're all anticipating and he's just driven kind of right across. Well, if Brian wasn't there, you would have gone right against the wall, taken the racing line. Let's have a look. What do you reckon? <sighs> oh, 
But I'm about to take off. I'm trying to stay out of the way of these guys. And it's like, oh, shit, 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 shit. I didn't want to come to a stop. This guy had already spun on the roll on the rolling start. I let too many people pass, but I wasn't involved. Yeah, your whole front end to the left of that patch when you guys make contact on my screen. And then I'm just trying to stay on the inside, try not to go too wide. If these guys room and they bounce back. And I got swamped. <clears throat> I say, does he have a spotter? So this is where Knackers just said, go for your life, boys. And there was only one other car. So I thought, no, I can tuck back into the racing line. Let these guys go three wide. Ah, it's all good, Matt. You're super fast, mate. And um, look forward to seeing you next time. That's Neville. So he that's his second off. And then we all know what happened from there. I'm just interested watching the chat. They're like ah! and then they're like, ah oh, well, it's all good, we'll see you next time. And that's what that's all about, isn't it? It's a great category, but participation has um, <laughs> varying levels of drivers at the moment. And that Thomas guy, I'm really annoyed with the way he was driving. I got to 641. There you go. Didn't even watch my times today. It was about racing. So with my issues yesterday, I lost 90 something. So we've gained 60 of that back. 112 points is not a bad effort. And I'll do as many of these as I can. Have a great day, guys. Thumbs up if you liked it. Down if you didn't. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you on track soon. Bye.